Alright guys. Alright guys, so I don't know why, but I had to retry that another three times before it finally gave me credit for that last uh, that last heart. That's okay. Takes off the same place. We just uh, finished killing Sauron and then we get the cutscene. And now we're here on the slopes of Mount Doom. And originally this is Elrond and uh, oh, that's not what I want. Originally this is Elrond and El uh, Isidore. Okay, so we got... What do we got? Magma armor. Okay, so another part of the treasure. And then... Uh, I need to be... Let's see, dwarf? Can we? And then you, Theodore. There you go, pick up the dwarf. There are a few things that we can do in this hidden area. Okay, I don't really need the stud so much, so let's skip that. Sam? Go up here, see what we got. Oh, uh, okay. That wasn't good. Gimli. Let's use a rope so we can get you up there too. And then you need to be a tall character, anyone will do. There we go. Oh, now we need to be Gollum. Don't, uh, why do you do that? By the way, guys, I'm not jumping. It is jumping when it gets off to the top of the wall. But unfortunately, his jumping is putting me over the wall. And I don't understand why. Uh, okay, Gimli. Get back up there. Oh, you can't make that jump, really? Okay, um... But you should, once I get you up there. Oh my god. There you go. Now, no, Gollum. What did that do for us? Mini kit? Mini kit. Okay, well, doesn't look like there's anything else up there anyway, so let's go down. Well, I'm not breaking stuff to get studs, I'm breaking stuff to make sure we don't miss anything. I don't see anything else here. Okay, let's break the portal. Oh. oh, like those statues we 
tried to destroy the first one we were here and we were missing one. There's the first one. Okay. There's that mini kit. And a strength character over here. Shimmering armor. Okay, is there anything in here that we're missing? Okay, we got the orange handle. We got the mini kit. I think that's it in here. We also got the statue. Oh, wait. There's supposed to be a design in here. Otherwise, we would have found it the first time. Cool, there it is. Okay, now I think we're done in here. Shoot the target. Um, I probably won't shoot the target because you're not using a bow. Shoot the target. There we go. Okay, so I'll give us a mini kit. Statue number two. there's anything in that dark hole that they came out of. Fredo, you've got a light? Anything in here? Mini kit? Okay, statue number three. Down. 
there was a mini kit back here that we already got, I believe. Alright, so what are we missing? Three mini kits, that's it. Okay. door. Uh, that should be, yep, last mini get. Okay, so that should be everything, so we'll go ahead and quit to Middle Earth. Save and exit. Make sure you save and exit so you keep all your goodies. So now, with all the stud mollets flyers on, we shouldn't have to farm studs. Whatever we kind of collect along the way should be good enough to buy all of our characters and bricks and everything. And we're building. Oh, Sora. Cool. Our treasures were the elven sword, the magma armor, and the shimmering armor. And blacksmith design for the Mithril Shockwave Axe. Nice. And two more. Oh, three more Mithril Bricks. That have been for the mini kits, the treasure, and the design. Cool. Alright, so I think we will pop back over to Bree again. Quicker to get there if I zoom out first. And we're going to make that Mithril Shockwave Axe so that anybody can use the axe. It's one of the last couple of things that not everybody can do. Uh, fire and the axe. Fire, we're not going to be able to make everybody be able to do that until we find the plan for the Mithril Tinderbox. And you will notice sometimes I switch to an item. Sometimes it's easier to just switch characters. Just whichever one is easiest for you. <laughs> okay, pop in here. With our Mithril Shockwave Axe. Should we do one more while we're here? Yeah, let's do uh, the vo the g disco vial because that means anybody can use a light instead of just Frodo. 
So we'll do that while we're here too. Awesome, shockwave axe. And... Cool. So, from these few treasures, now anybody can break cracked Lego bricks. Unless they're high in the air. Then you still need to throw a Gimli, but... Ones that are on the ground, or on a wall, that's near ground level, anybody can break those now. And with the disco vial, anybody can create light to go into dark places. Okie dokie. And then what I think we'll do next is go deliver the stuff that we've collected so far and forged so far. So let's go to hmm. well, let's look at the map. Is there anything that we have new that we can deliver in Bree? No, Bree is waiting for a stop wand and a house key. Uh, not Bree, um, Hobbiton. So Bree, we're waiting for mushroom crown and a soup pot and an umbrella. Oh, we need to pick up that design too. Might as well do that while we're here. <sighs> Except I don't see my stud trail. Alright, well we'll do that when we examine Bree. Let's leave let's leave that for now. Okay, weather top. We've got a design. Were there no quests in Weathertop? No, there are. There are two quests in Weathertop. Where are they? Oh, here they are. Alright, so so he's waiting for his ice bow. Where's the other one from Weathertop? This is what Yeah. Stud mallet we don't have yet, but we can go deliver the ice bow, so let's do that. And yeah, let's mark it. Got another race over here, too. <laughs> Maybe we'll do some more collecting of stuff in the next one. Alright, dude, here's your ice bow. I'm truly grateful. What does he have? Regenerate hearts, which we already have from the code, but buying the red brick is what's going to actually uh, give the um, completion. Okay, what am I doing? Map. Okay, so next was Rivendell. Okay, you're waiting for a pen, a luminous stone, mithril gloves, three quests, is that right? Yep, okay, so moving on to Karadris or four quests. Alright, you wanted Beard comb, magma rock, horn, and sun hat. Okay. Don't have anything for you. Lothlorien had three quests. Aha! We do have something in Lothlorien. Actually, we, no, we don't have the carrot bow. But we do have the shockwave back. So let's go over there. 
deliver the shockwave axe. Let's go ahead and mark that. There we go. going yeah go down so easy to get lost here all right there's your shockwave axe Gen Hanon. I think that was thank you in which case you're welcome Fall Rescue, which once again we've already got the code for, but now we have it legitimately. Okay. I'm on Hen. One of three quests, do we have anything to deliver? Doesn't look like it. Okay. And then wheel, which I don't think had any quests. Dead marshes. There are three quests here, which we have the headdress for. So let's hop over there and deliver the headdress. And as we're delivering this stuff, one of the things that we'll deliver is the item for, I think it was the shield. And that will give us the Mithril Shield, and that will give us the other, the last dead multiplier. Which way? This way. over to Gollum. Okay, there's your headdress. Mithril heart. So that means everybody can have Mithril hearts instead of just um, Frodo. Sorry guys, phone. Silence that. Okay, um let's see. I'm trying to think of my storyline so that we go in the right order here, or at least in an order that I can keep up with. Uh so after Dead Marshes would be Edoras. Where's Edoras? Here we go. Ah, he's our shield. So here's where we get our studs times eight. Oh, you know what? I think he's actually technically at Helm's Deep, isn't he? Based on the way it's taking us. Looks like he's actually at Helm's Deep. Okay. So if it, he's at Helm's Deep, then that means I don't actually have anything else to deliver here. So rather than trek all the way over there, we'll just do this. No, it's not you. Oh, this way. Up the hill. 